Assalamu alaikum guys in this video we will solve problem we have to find stresses in a body uh, the bot this is the original body uh, then it is inclined at 50 degree so we will solve this uh, uh, problem uh, by Mohr circle we are given sigma x sigma y tau xy and the inclination which is 50 so let's do it first of all we have to <clears throat> find the center of the circle more circle so c is the center uh, now the coordinates of the circle would be sigma x plus sigma y divided by 2 and 0 this zero shows that the, the center of the circle would be on the x axis which is uh, sigma so by calculating center is 16 and 0 now we have to find the radius the formula of the radius is Sigma x minus sigma y divided by 2 whole square plus sigma x y square. Uh, the radius is 9.43 mega Pascal. Uh, now we have to find the range. So center minus radius is 6.57. Uh, you can say mega Pascal and center plus radius is 25.43 I'm drawing a wedge here this is B phase uh, this is A and let me say this is D now the forces on the B phase B phase A phase D phase B phase has, uh, as it is outward, which shows that uh, uh, it is um, tension, so 21 mega, uh, mega Pascal, and the shear force on that phase is H, and this is negative. How if, uh, I find that it is negative um, by doing this? Uh, keep this end of the arrow pivot and move it to the body it would uh, rotate like uh, anti-clockwise shear force is uh, moving anti-clockwise then it is negative Now you have to fix the scale uh, as you would draw the, uh, the more circle on the graph paper then it would be more accurate. Uh, I would show you on the graph paper but I am drawing it on the simple plane. Uh, Now we have circles 16 with coordinates 16 and 0. The center of the circle would be here 16 and 0. 11 which would be here. Sorry, here. And positive 8, it would be here. It is the point with coordinates 11 and plus 8 now what you have to do you have to put your compass here and draw a circle with the radius so it would be like so after that it would be like that after that, B would be in straight line. Ah, this would be the B. You can check 
this would be um, as you would uh, make it uh, with the proper scaling uh, then uh, the B point would be 21 and minus H. Now you have to find the D. Uh, we know the inclination. In the question we have given inclination was 50. And I have told earlier uh, in the other video that uh, in Mohor circle the inclination would be double. Now uh, to us it would be 100 degree. Uh, you have to move 100 degree to as it is uh, uh, the angle is positive you have to move toward the anti-clockwise. Anti-clockwise angle is positive. So of, uh, at 100 degree let's say this is uh, at that point it is 100 degrees from uh, the line center to B then this point would be D. I hope you can see it. Uh, this is the more circle for this question but this point is B this is A and this is D point. Yeah. Yeah. Please subscribe Please. and like this video. Yeah. I hope you like that.